You're watching Hawaii News Now Sunrise. Coming up on 750, let's take you back in time. On this day, five years ago, Senator Daniel Akaka announced his retirement. Senator Akaka was 86 years old at the time. Despite his age and serving 22 years in the U.S. Senate, Akaka was the junior senator to the late Senator Daniel Inouye. Akaka's career in Washington spanned more than three decades. We have more day in history type stories in a special section on our website. That's at hawaiinewsnow.com. The Rainbow Warrior basketball team has seen it all this season sanctions, injuries, a player quitting with two games left in the regular season, but the Bows have showed they can handle it all and then some. Not only on the verge of clinching just their third conference title in program history, but game by game, the Bows are etching themselves into their UH record books as one of the best teams ever alongside the original NCAA tournament team of 71-72 season or the last to reach the big dance in 2001 and 2002. I've seen the brilliance on the floor, you know, and everybody stepping up and coming to the plate and uh, doing what they need to do. I see a lot of that in, uh, in, in our team. When it came time to play in games, we rallied together, we came together, and we tried to perform as one. I think this team is doing the same thing. To build for the future, you have to honor your past. You to honor your past, you better study your past. And so we do that here and there, but th these guys are writing their own story. And that's what the best part for all of us. They've taken us all along for a great ride. Now let's give you kind of an update here. It's a three horse race for the league title entering the final weekend of the regular season. You see Irvine trails the Bows by a game. Long Beach State is two back. One win in the final two games guarantees UH at least a share of the title as well as the number one seed in the Big West tournament and an automatic NIT berth. The Bows will play. That's UC Davis tomorrow night. 5 o'clock Hawaii time, they're playing away in California. Today is National Read Across America Day, and we're celebrating it on March 2nd because it's Dr. Seuss's birthday. And the goal is to encourage children and teens to read. Let's get you over to Dan Cook for a look at your weather. Thank you, Billy, very much.